Hello and welcome back to WePC. Now in this video we're going to show you how to easily underclock your GPU. Now you might be wondering if it is even possible for you to underclock your GPU. And it's an interesting question in a world where overclocking is king, but if you're looking for ways to safely underclock your GPU, then you are in the right place. However, do you need to underclock your GPU in the first place? For example, if you only use your computer to browse the internet or only do mild gaming, underclocking your GPU is fine. This should reflect lower electricity bills without sacrificing any drops in performance. As well as this, if you live in the western countries, the summer season is a great time to do underclocking to reduce temperatures. So what is the benefit? Well, it's kind of like a domino effect. Lower power consumption lowers the clock speeds of your GPU, and it leads to running the hardware at a slower pace. This means it consumes lesser power, and since your hardware is running at lower speeds, the hardware is not forced to produce more output, fewer usage results in cooler temperatures, as well as creating a more silent fan. A GPU that is overclocked requires higher fan RPMs to keep up with the usage while cooling the hardware at the same time. So if you are certain that you will benefit by underclocking your GPU, then proceed to follow these steps. Firstly, what you're going to want to do is download the MSI Afterburner. You can find this by going to Google and typing in MSI Afterburner download and getting it from their website. After the installation is complete, open up MSI Afterburner. See that your graphics card is detected before making any adjustments. Lower or under clock the core clock megahertz meter you will find at the center according to your preferred adjustment settings. After you have done so, click on the apply button to override the adjustments made. Now save the adjustments you made to your preferred profile slot number. And that is simply it, that is how to underclock your GPU. Not everyone needs an overclocked GPU, there are users who use only a little or enough memory from how much memory their graphics cards can deliver. If you are certain that you don't need too much of your GPU's capacity, then follow these steps and adjust your settings respective to your needs. Underclocking should give you the benefit of reduced energy bills if that is a problem for you. Anyway guys, that is our video. If it helped you at all, we would love if you could leave a like on the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload, and we'll see you in the next one.